The family of the late Ronaldo Olanya Lapa accuses the minister of encroaching and forcefully tilling their ancestral land located in Lalia, a Gong village in Anaka sub county, Noya district. Lapa's surviving sons claim their father acquired the land in the early 60s, but the land was underutilized due to the recurrent attack by stray elephants from Makshan Falls National Game Park, which borders the area. That is where he, has, he claims to have bought and built his, his base. So now he's extending his, his farmland from where he claims to have bought from the family of uh, Opil towards this site, which engulfs almost the entire 1,300 acres, which we also lay claim 100%. They plow around the building and they tell you not to trespass on their garden because they have a gun. The family's estate administrators, Francis Odong and Patrick Akim Ojok, say grabbers took advantage of their vulnerability and fraudulently sold off the land to the minister. We want to know who sold to him the land. How did they acquire the land? The neighbors are all here. Who are the neighbors who are present? Who was the local leader who was involved in this sale? We have done this. We have called two meetings so far. We used uh, the LC1 to call for a meeting. He never appeared. We organized another meeting through the LC3. He never appeared. The matter was brought to the attention of the local area authorities, led by Maurice Opio Kakanyero, the Anaka sub-county chairperson, who reports that a move to hold meetings and identify the facts on the ground has yielded no fruit. I wrote the letter calling for the parties so that we see a way out. Personally, I wanted the Honorable Minister for Northern Uganda to come and justify the situation. Because in a nutshell, the constitution of Uganda provides for anybody to acquire land, to own land, and the process of acquiring the land must be a bit smooth. They accused the Minister of Hiring Rowdy Youth and Security Operatives to irregularly plow the area, stage illegal roadblocks, and destroy existing structures on the land. However, Minister Kenneth Omona has described the allegations as baseless, emphasizing that he genuinely bought the land and is utilizing it as required. I don't have any case in police here. Yeah? I am always Northern Uganda here. I'm always here. I have not been summoned to any, case, any court that have uh, trespassed. I have held meetings with villagers in that area. Two times where I called all the entire village. The family has lodged their complaints by writing to the Office of the President, Chief of Defense Forces, State House Investors Protection Unit and Office of the Prime Minister to come to their aid.